let's get started here. My name is Austin. I'm your host. And this is your boy Ross and I'm your co-host. And today I brought to the table a little conversation I'm going to have with you that's more male related. Yeah, so if you're a kid, this is more about adult. Uh, talk a little more, you know, yeah. I mean, I'm sure you've experienced this, but again, <laughs> for warning, this is for mostly This adults. is more adult talk, more, <sighs> more, ma ma mature, more mature. Mature audiences. Yeah, so uh, I have a question and it is, do you think watching adult films as a male is wrong whether you're single, dating, engaged, or married? My opinion, no. I don't think that. I mean, obviously when you're single, it's, you do what you it's want. It's easier. To. It's easier. So, but if you're engaged or you have a girlfriend or if you have a wife, do I think it's wrong? No. However, I do think it would be appropriate to ask your fiance, your girlfriend, or your wife, or just tell her, you know, and just kind of communicate with her, see what, no. But you don't want to go but do it, necessarily want to do it behind her back. Okay, so, but, uh, uh, take the single part out of it. Yeah, yeah. Because most single people are going to pleasure themselves. Right. That's true. I mean, they just don't, they don't have nobody. Right. Or That's they're messing around. But outside of that, do you think if you're engaged to someone, so your your theory is if you're engaged, as long as you have, like, the conversation with your significant other or, like, your, your girlfriend, your fiancé or wife. Yeah. You get that permission from them, basically, that it's something that doesn't bother them. Now, I'll say for me, like, for an example, me, I don't. I don't need to. With, I, I'm married, and we have enough sexy time. Is what we'll call it. We have we have enough sexy time to where I don't need to do that to myself. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. But I think that if you want to watch, you know, an adult film, right, and you want to do that to yourself, I think there's no issue with it because I, I don't I don't care if you gotta hide it I think if you wanna hide it hide it but if you get caught you're gonna take the consequences of it but I think if you wanna do it it's a fan a fantasized video for people to get off yeah I mean it's everyone's done it even females not we're, and this, well, yeah, this not is, just a male thing it's not a male conversation self pleasurement this is, is it <laughs> both to, genders uh, or everyone. nowadays all genders mm -hmm. So exactly. So happens to everybody. We're not just talking about males. We're talking about actually human. We're saying males male because and females. we're males. But yeah, this is more directed toward male. But let's just. I bring. Okay. So the question was brought up to me that I got asked, "Do I pleasure myself?" Which my wife asked me, and I said, "Well, there's no point. Like, we have enough." time together yeah. in one week, every week, that I just don't see the need. Like, I don't have that, what's it called, that urge, right, that urge. to go do it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Now, I also know people, like I got friends that will go watch it, because I ask them the same question. They'll go watch it just to watch it. Like, they won't please themselves. Right. Like, they, they honestly just go to watch that 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 watch, fantasize. fantasize yeah and some people do it that you know I I be honest with you I, some I do that sometimes from time to time get kind of like I'll just sit there and I'll just watch it I won't pleasure them you know but I'll just sit there and watch it so and a lot of times and I <laughs> tell me that I'm here a lot of times when I'm doing that I'm learning new ways to which some people do. I've done please it. my wife, and that's trying to learn those different ways. I'm not going on there necessarily to do what yeah. you think I'm doing. Yeah, well, that's like so. me. I mean, I agree because <laughs> not now, but you know, before I, I went on there and been like, you know what, I want to try that. I want to do this. I want to do that. 
And, you know, sometimes you, it's a hit or miss. You know, your spouse is a, like, okay, I don't want to try that. Yeah. Or it's, okay, we can try that. Yeah. So sometimes watching these, you know, adult films can help right. your relationship. And just being, excuse me, spontaneous or, what what's it, uh, trying to get that spark. Spark, yeah. Back that time. spark back, you know, that, that helps sometimes. Because I'll go ahead and tell you. Like, I'm very open, I'm very spontaneous, like, I like the difference. Like, I'm not your common, lay on your back, let's do it until we're done. Right. Like, I'm just, that's not me. Right. And my sex drive is probably, like, 210%. Like, while I still, <laughs> I go ahead right now, I still fuck like a 16-year-old. So, I mean, <laughs> hey. I, I'm just saying. I, I Not wish, many. I, I wish I could say the same thing. I I do have my share of sexy time. Let's put it that way. But sorry, I didn't mean to go all F. Oh no, that's fine. Hey, that's, you know, that's you know, this is BS. This is edited. Anyway, <laughs> but well, I mean, we're just sitting here having a conversation. Just, so. Yeah, well, that's, that's okay. Exactly so what it is. would you would you ever hide it <laughs> from your wife? I my I would not. No. You wouldn't. I would. You're just be a up you're an honest person though. So. I would be more upfront. Have I done it? Have I done it? And kept it from her? Yes. But learning from that experience, it's not, you know, I don't want to have to go through that, you know, phase where she's upset or where she's mad or I'm like, got caught. Am I an asshole because I don't care? No, you're just being honest. Like, you know if, you want, if y'all want to comment and let me know, I'm, like, <clears throat> if my wife asked me, I would lie. If I, you know, if I did, right. So even if I did, I would lie. But I don't know if that makes me an asshole because I don't care. I don't know if that makes me like a shitty person. I don't think so because like I don't sleep with. Okay, this leads into the next part. Yeah. <laughs> so leading into the next part is the reason I don't think you know it's that big a deal is because. If you're only sleeping with that, like you're okay. So us, if you're sleeping with your wife, right, right, no one else. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter what you do. It doesn't matter what video you watch. It doesn't matter if you walk by a girl and check her ass out. Right. That's as long right. as you're going home to that woman, your wife, it's mm -hmm. sleeping with that woman, your wife, and that's it. Exactly. I don't see no problem with it. Cause yeah. I tell you right now, I told you earlier. It's human nature to look at the opposite sex, or my mother God. Nowadays, it's same sex, opposite sex, like diagonal sexes, straight sexes, <laughs> like horizontal sexes. Like no, what? I don't care what it is you do, but it's human nature to look at what whatever it is you're attracted to. Like, yeah. so if you're a man and you're attracted to a woman, it's you're gonna look at a woman, mm -hmm. no matter what. It is, and it doesn't mean that you think that your wife is not as pretty as that girl. It just, it's, 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 it's just that you just, it's just like when someone, when a girl, whether she's pretty or not, regardless of how you view, this is your preference, whatever your preference is, might not be hot for anybody else. But if you look at her another way, if you look at that person, it doesn't mean you're going to take that woman home and sleep with her, no. No. No, I think that's a. I don't think that's a bad idea. No. I. I mean, looking at another woman, like you know, just that if you stared at her for a couple minutes, might might want to talk to. No, that's her just wife. creepy. That's just creepy. <laughs> that's just, it's okay to like. But if you, to me, if you're just glancing and just like, wow. Okay, so. Is fine. Then I don't see. I don't see, no, I don't see no. nothing wrong with checking out the opposite, op or whatever it is you're attracted to. Right. I would say opposite sex, but nowadays it's everything. Yeah, so, my wife probably say the same thing. She you think she would nice, agree? Good, I don't think so. Because it leads I'm into not, my uh, next question is, so if me and my wife are watching a movie, hypothetically the Thor movie, yeah. okay, she can sit there and tell me how hot Thor is. Yeah. Which don't get me wrong, good looking man. Like, right. I'm not, I'm not like gay no. or nothing, but 
I'm 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 more comfortable with my sexuality to where I can tell you when a guy looks good or not. Right. That's yeah. That's Thor is a good looking man. Yeah, okay. I mean. So when she's like, "Man, that Thor," and I'm like, yeah, "That's a good looking dude." But when Black Widow comes out in the other Avengers, I'm like, "Damn." Scotch like I'm like, yeah, <laughs> like damn girl, like uh, yeah. she's like, yeah. my, she gets mad. Yeah, I mean, my wife gets mad. But uh, my good. question is real quick because we ain't got much time left. Uh, why is it they can get mad at us for doing the exact same thing they can? I guess, in my opinion, I guess the female, like. Thinking is they feel insecure more than the guys were feeling insecure. Yeah, I guess it is. I guess it is more it's female. It's more. Thing. I, I think I don't know scientifically that's a fact, but I do know that's just kind of what I have seen over the past what year since I met my wife. So I I think it's just more insecurity thing or insecurity for a woman. To yeah. Feel that way. Then a guy would do it. I don't care if you look at Thor that way. It doesn't bother me a bit. You're still sleeping with me. So. I just don't care. As long as you're <laughs> sleeping with me and no one else, I don't care. Yeah. That's so, just how I've always been. Now, I will say, in my younger years, I, I was probably more the jealous type. Yeah. But I think I think that's a part of maturing. This is maturing. And some women, they don't, some people, women don't care. Some nah. more do. And some don't, some them, do. And that's... Most of the people, most of the women, will say it's they feel insecure, but it's, that's that's you know, that's normal yeah. for you to feel that way. I mean, that's true. And just men in general, just they don't really care. <laughs> I mean, and if you're sleeping, if you're coming to bed with me, it doesn't matter what you look at during the day. Yeah. Well, I mean, that's you just go like, downtown and hang out with a guy for all I care, as long as you're not. Holding hands, guessing, and making out. Okay, so that's just like me. You can, you can literally text me and say, "Hey, I know you're going to be out of town next weekend. My wife is going to be out of town. Is it okay if me and Lauren go eat lunch with a group of like a, together or a group of friends just because we're going to be at home and we, we ain't got no plans?" Yeah, I'd like. Yeah, go ahead. Right. I mean, the same with mine. If she would have done the same thing. I don't care. Yeah, but I it bother me now. I don't think it's that big. As long as you have trust, it ain't that big an issue. That's that's the thing. That's honestly that's all it's about. Trusting, yeah. If you could trust your partner, your spouse, that's then really all no it boils down. That's yeah. all it boils down to. You have well, no worries. So. Well, that's a good conversation. I don't know if we really made a point. We didn't, I don't know. That's but you got right. our you got our opinion on it, so that's all that matters. That's really all that matters. And uh, <laughs> but like always, at the end of our videos, we'll you know subscribe. Subscriptions don't really matter anymore, so like that video, like, 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 and then when you get done liking, subscribe just so you can keep up with our videos. Our next video coming up will be about OnlyFans. What do you think about OnlyFans? Do you think it's okay to look at OnlyFans? Do you think it's worth spending your money on any OnlyFans uh, person? I don't know what you would call them. Uh, yeah. Whatever. I don't know. User. What uh, user. OnlyFans user. user. Yeah, there we go. That's Do you think it's worth it? So our next video, if you keep an eye out, we'll explain what we think about OnlyFans, what our wives think about OnlyFans, and that'll be exactly probably about all we can get to next time. Right. right. So, until next time, just this is Bearded Ink. You guys enjoy. Yeah. <laughs>